Welcome to Moo Moo Math, where we upload a new math video every day. In this video, I'd like to work on word problems that can be solved using a one-step equation. And so, once you have the equation set up, they're pretty easy to solve. But the um, key to these is trying to looking at the word problem and figuring out what information is given. So let's go ahead and jump right in. The first one, a bag of super hound dog food at $12.85 per bag is one-third the price of Power Mutt dog food. What is the price of a bag of Power Mutt dog food? So let's first set up what the equation is. We know that um, we have the price of the Super Hound and then we, ha we need to know, so mutt, mutt dog food is X. And what do we know about X? Well, we know that X is one third the price of the super hound dog food. So we're going to do divided by three and that is going to equal the super hound dog food. It must be a premium dog food. So now this is our equation. X divided by three equals two dollars and eighty-five cents. Now let's go ahead and solve that. We have X divided by three is equal to twelve dollars and eighty-five cents. You know with a one-step equation what you do to one side you must do to both. To get rid of the division we will multiply both sides by 3. That will eliminate the 3. So the 3's cancel. So X is left with $12.85 times 3 which is $38.55. So the solution is $38.55. Okay, let's go ahead and look at number two. Cheyenne went for a walk. While she was walking, a dollar and thirty-five cents fell out of her pocket. When she returned home, she counted her money, and she had two dollars and fifty-five cents left. How much what money was in Cheyenne's pocket before she started her walk? Okay, so she starts her grand total. Let's call that X. And what had happened was was she had X minus two fifty-five because that's how much was left when she got home. And that is going to equal the $1.35 that fell out of her pocket. So what we will do, let's go ahead and solve that. So we have X minus 255 is equal to $1.35. This was her grand total. She uh, counted her money when she got home, so she had 255 so we're going to track the, subtract the grand total minus the amount she got when she got home and that's going to equal how much fell out while she was walking. Okay, So now we know uh, to undo a subtraction we're going to do an addition and so we'll do that to both sides. So when she got home the 255's cancel X is going to equal to $3.90. Okay. So the solution is $3.90. And finally, okay guys, let's go ahead and look at problem number three. It says the perimeter of a triangle is 52.3 centimeters. If two sides equal measure equal 36.87, what is the length of the third side? To get perimeter of a triangle, you add the three sides, the length of the three sides. So you have one length of this plus the length of two plus the length of three. Well, the length of two sides is given and we have the grand total. So we will set this up. We will say X plus the length of the two sides, which is 36.87, is going to eat equal the total perimeter length of 52.3. We know that now we just solve for the one-step equation. To get rid of the 36.87, we will subtract both sides. So we have 36.87 on this side and we will do the same on the other side 36.87 and then when you subtract those two that is 15 excuse me not 14 15.43 centimeters so therefore the length of X is equal to 15.43 centimeters thanks for watching hope these help with one-step equations Moo Moo Math uploads a new math video every day.